Today we're going to look at and compare Aperture Grill through a Sony PVM versus Slot Shadow Mask through a Pro Grade Monitor and through a Consumer Grade CRT. So we have the Tower of Power assembled and on top we have the little 14 inch AF Toshiba with the Consumer Slot Mask. In the middle, we have the Sony 1344Q PVM with the aperture grill. And on the bottom, we have the Ikigami TM14-17R professional color monitor. Here is a close-up of the consumer slot mask. Here we have aperture grill. And here we have a pro monitor slot mask. Both Ikigamis that I own have the Hitachi slot mask tubes that are really nice. And here for shits and giggles is an extreme close up of the same image on a 4K LCD. This is not going to be a huge technical background on all these different technology tubes. It's just going to be a showcase of the three side by side. And even then it's not fair because after recording this, I figured out somebody had switched my Sony into the warm color mode. And it seems like the Ikigami and the consumer set were overexposed. And that Sony just seemed to pick up and translate better to camera. Take it all with a grain of salt. This would just give you a general idea. In real life, I think the Ikigami looks amazing in a different way than the Sony. I think they both look amazing. Also, this was recorded before I stretched out the horizontal and vertical size and positioning on that Ikigami. You get the idea. I'm going to shut the hell up now.
that's going to wrap this one up the next video i'm going to show setting the convergence rings on that 1344q so stay tuned don't forget to like and subscribe <laughs>